we just got to stay aggressive. And Get to the corner. Good pass. Corner. Now shoot that. Pop Over that. 4-3. Oh, fuck. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to LaMelo Ball, my career. In our last video, we took on the New Zealand Breakers and we got the job done, as you guys can see. So we lead the series 2-1. Uh, we are one win away from participating in the NBL Finals and completing LaMelo Ball's my career journey. So the Melbourne United were uh, eliminated. So we will not be seeing them in the finals. The Adelaide 36ers will be in the finals. So we've got game number four coming up for you guys in today's video. Game number four and five. Um, this will wrap up the series with the New Zealand Breakers and we'll have a conclusion of what has happened. Well, basically conclusion to the RJ Hampton Lamar matchup that has basically been going on from the entire year. I think they've played each other like five times. New Zealand have won a few times and so have the Hawks. But I will be doing LaMelo Ball in the NBA, so make sure to look out for that. I'm going to try and revamp, maybe revamp some things. Might do it on the PC so we can have some mods and all that kind of good stuff. But today's video, it is game four. It is the Hawks taking on the Breakers. Actually, games four and five. So let's get into games four. And here we are. So it's the Breakers and the Hawks in New Zealand. This is just a quick highlight of game four. Um, basically just like a summary of what happened because this was probably our most disappointing game of the season. So let's get this game underway and I'll just explain to you why we show off some highlights, just how poor we were. So New Zealand come out of this game red, ha red hot out of the blocks. You see a nice pass here from the Mellow Ball. They were just all over. So look at RJ cooking Lamelo. pull up green light. That is good. They just jumped us early. You can see here, get that weak stuff out of here. We are not swinging. There is no way we're going to make that uh, with two centers in the key. But Mallo Ball was struggling from the field. So it was really up to his passing to keep us in it. But as you guys can see, we fell down by 20 points in this second term. Lamello going all the way. Get a little bit of life back into this game. We'll just This was probably our worst game as Lamello Ball in my career. RJ Hampton in the third here gets it to go. And I didn't really want to show too much highlights of this game because this New Zealand team come to play and this New Zealand team come to force a deciding game. Another and one for the Breakers. I just had to wrap this game up. I could not talk about this game too much. We are going to a deciding game. The Breakers absolutely annihilate us. And as you guys can see, the Mallow Ball, 15 points, 14 rebounds and 8 assists. Still was on triple-double watch, but we just struggled. We had no answer, absolutely no answer for uh, the Breakers in this one. As we move on to the main event, the real game of the video, game number five. Whoever wins this, wins the series, the Breakers and the Hawks. So we're back at home, which will give us a little bit of confidence boost. Um, this is this will be extended highlights of the game. Mallow pulling up. Things are starting to be different considering how poorly we played in game number four. Mallow goes inside, gets it to go. He was extremely aggressive in this game. I thought to myself, it doesn't really matter about the assist. It doesn't matter about all that kind of stuff. I have to be aggressive. We're going to be any chance of winning this game. Mallow inside. You cannot stop him in the fast break. That's all I'm going to say. Still like weighing up what team LaMelo Ball will go to in the NBA once we get there and once we have the NBA our series and season. As you see, RJ Hampton throw it down. This game was back and forth. It definitely was a tough game for us. Um, we were trying everything to get... We were. I was I was forcing a lot of things in this game. I was not going to lose... I was going to do my best not to lose this game. RJ Hampton again, keeping New Zealand in this. But in the fast break, I've said it before, you're not stopping Mallow as he goes in and throws it down. Lamelo Ball has gone to a new level in these playoffs. If you go back and look at all the other videos, um, some of his highlights have just been crazy. Nice in there, just doesn't get it to go. And then it is back and forth. But have a look at this alley-oop from Lamelo Ball. He goes back door and catches it. I think I've catched like maybe three or four alley-oops this season, but that is um, probably his, his best work so far. Great pass there from RJ Hampton. He is going to be a force in the NBA. Look at Mallow pulling up at the buzzer. Doesn't get it to go. But at quarter time, we lead 24 to 17. We move on to the second term, and we were struggling a little bit, but look at Boone. Misses it. We still have a chance, though. Nice little pass back, and we get it to go. I don't know how Boone missed that dunk. If you uh, watched Josh Boone, have a look at that dunk uh, when Lamelo Ball crossed over his opponent twice. And uh, Josh Boone missed the dunk. I think uh, people people will realize just when, once we get to the NBA that the the talent of players who we are going to have uh, when we roll out. So at, at the half, it is 39-39. I was subbed out. And in this second half, it is up to LaMelo Ball to take over and go and lead this Hawks team to a finals berth. Because we are trying to win this NBL finals. 
Um, I felt like New Zealand were the toughest matchup for us. RJ Hampton, green light again, ties the game up. It is back and forth at this point. They are sticking around. Mallow gets that to go, and we are pressing. So Mallow, 27 points at this point. I didn't really, it didn't really phase me how much points we had in this game. Um, I just had to keep scoring, had to keep it alive. If you see that Ogilvy gets a really nice dunk. Look at Mallow pull up here. I thought that was good. Just misses it. But he's going all the way here. You're not stopping him. Around the back, passes out, open three. He knocks it down, and we have a nice little lead here in this third term. Our main goal at home is just to try and close them out as soon as possible. We do not want to give him a chance to come back into this game. Um, at this stage here, you see Mallow get the nice alley -oop pass. We are really taking over here. 64-51. But this New Zealand Breakers team definitely do not give up. They definitely came. They came hard. Josh Boone again. Lamello balls out here throwing lobs. 69-53. to Things are looking okay. Things are looking much better as we were subbed out. So we got subbed out till the four, I think four minutes ago in the last. We have a comfortable 19-point lead. Things are looking good. For the Hawks. Mallow to put some icing on the cake and send us to the finals. The Hawks are going to the NBL finals. Uh, we've got one more series to go. And then it is the NBA for Lamello Ball. What a series this has been. Um, it's been a long series. It's been a lot of videos, a lot of episodes. But we are almost there. We are finally almost there. But four seconds to go. RJ Hampton with his last shot for the Breakers. And we close out New Zealand. So the Hawks are going to the NBL finals. They are hoisting the trophy. Uh, they've beat everyone in their path, and now it is the Adelaide 36ers who we must take on for the championship, the NBL championship in LaMelo Ball's first year with the Hawks and only year in the NBL. So I hope you guys enjoyed the RJ Hampton battle. It went it went the distance. Uh, the Hawks just a little bit too good. We were blown out in a few games, uh, but the games that counted, the games that mattered, we got the job done. The next videos will be the NBL Finals before we head off to the NBA Draft and get into the NBA. It's been a long series. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next LaMelo Ball video.